Magic wizards riding unicorns are not real. I will let that sink in. Magic wizards riding unicorns are not real. By which I mean that there is no literal, physical, actual manifestation of a phenomenon in the material world that the phrase, magic wizards riding unicorns, would properly define. Are you with me so far? They're not real. They're made up. And yet, when I say magic wizards riding unicorns, you know what I mean. If you speak English, that is. Obviously, I'd have to run it through Google Translate to make it intelligible to people who don't speak my language. Let them go. When I say magic wizards riding unicorns, rather, when my lips tongue, lungs, and diaphragm work in concert to send certain vibrations into the air, which are detected by the sensitive membranes in your eardrum and reorganized by your brain into the speech pattern, magic wizards riding unicorns, you know what I am saying. You have an abstract image in your head that is representing this concept. It may not be exactly the same as the image I have in my head that caused me to utter this phrase, but it is certainly similar enough to be considered isomorphic. Now, maybe your wizard looks more like Gandalf, while my wizard looks more like Orko. Maybe your unicorn has white hair, and mine has black. Maybe you're imagining a wizard on a winged horse. That's not a unicorn! That's a pegasus! Or maybe you really weren't paying attention, and now you are imagining a magic wizard riding Unicron. Let it go. The point is, through the power of abstract thought and language, I have created something in my head that has no actual, literal, physical manifestation, etc., etc. And I have communicated this concept to you, and you understand what I mean by it, even though there is no counterpart to it in the real world. We take this ability for granted, but it is the foundation of all fiction, all myth, all deceit. We create mental constructs like justice, and nothing, and evil, and the future, and we use them to compartmentalize aspects of the world that outside of these abstractions in our minds, cannot be said to exist in any form. We take this ability for granted, but it is more magic than any number of wizards or unicorns could ever be. And it is real. <laughs>